All right, welcome back to the Nas Fast channel. We've got an unboxing, so say hello to Ren and Stippy and Powder Toast Man and Log and TV and Charlie Brown's up here and Gimli's over there and yeah, everybody. But anyway, and I'm right here. I'm behind the camera. So, hello. <laughs> All right, so I know you've been seeing a lot of unboxings of what I'm about to unbox, uh, but this is the only one you really need to watch. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. You can watch the rest of them. Uh, but uh, yeah, this is something I've been waiting for. was supposed to get it yesterday. USPS decided I didn't need it till today. So there we go. Uh, I'm going to be using my Jack Wolf Knives Midnight Jack as my unboxing knife. So let's get into this. Now, I'm going to take it off camera because there is a label on like three sides here. So I apologize for that, as I know that makes for absolutely boring tv now that thing just got right down in there and i just love it now the reason we're using that is we have another jack wolf here this is modern interpretation of a timeless design jack wolf knives and there of course uh, you know some of you probably have still haven't read this story and if you haven't please do it and then let's see what we have now guys i gotta tell you 2021, June of 2021, I was at Blade Show and I met Ben Belkin and I did an interview. If you didn't see that Blade Show video, go watch it. It's got like 15,000 views. Go make it a, one or two more. Um, and uh, I met Ben and I picked up this prototype right here. Now, it was the Riot prototype at the time. Uh, and that's not who makes these uh, knives. He, he has another company, which we don't know who it is, uh, making these over in China as well. Uh, but, oh, man, I'm going to shut up for a minute. Look at that. Oh, yeah. And then this artwork. Look at that guy. He's like, oh, yeah. And then you got Jack Wolf there looking all tough. Man, Sean Tiffany kills it. We had Jack. We had Jack. We had Ben on the uh, KF Live last night, and it was a lot of fun. Really, really cool. And, man, the, his just presentation here is absolutely phenomenal. Now, um, so anyway, I saw this one at Blade Show. There you go. Of all the prototypes he had, there's the Pog. Uh, I knew this was going to be the one that I really wanted, and I made that very clear to Ben at the time, and then I dropped stuff on the floor, and I made that very clear to Ben at the time, and he absolutely knew it, and so it's hilarious that we're finally here, and Ben has applauded me for being so patient, but guys, I wasn't very patient I really could not wait. There's your leather slip uh, in there. You got a really, really nice, beautiful dark brown leather slip. We're going to put this uh, over here. Uh, we also got this awesome walk and talk sticker. And Jack Wolf's like, oh, yeah, look at that. Uh, very, very cool. And then it comes in the burrito here of this awesome, uh, awesome microfiber cloth. I love the burrito uh, and look at the size of this cloth. If you have not gotten one of these yet, just get the knife. I know they're expensive, but just get the knife so you can have the cloth. No, I'm just kidding. These are the greatest cloths. I mean, they really, really are. Let's put it right here where you can sort of see it. Oh, come on. I'm doing a very bad job. There we go. And here is the knife. Now, I uh, really love this twill carbon fiber Oh, and already I can tell I, I really love it, man. Uh, look at the shine. I cannot wait to get this. I'm going to take this straight outside in a minute and take some pictures with it. This thing is sick. And with that gray titanium, uh, yes, look at that. Really, really cool. Uh, you have, um, obviously, uh, you have a bolster here and a um, in. Oh, uh, now, Ben, I'm going to forget the name of it again. In cap. I don't think that's right. Uh, but anyway, the way it is, it's a solid piece of titanium, and it's milled down in here for this carbon fiber. And man, where they inserted it, you do not. I mean, because they're finishing these as one unit, and you just don't get that. You know, the, you don't feel the transitions. And then look at this. You got this back spring that's got this dog leg in it. Uh, and you just, oh, come on, focus, camera, focus. All right, there we go. You just don't, there, there's, it's just gorgeous. Look at that. It's still just one seamless piece. Now, when we open this blade, which I'm not going to look at yet, uh, you get this great transition because they finished it. Oh, my goodness. 
Okay, so here's why, guys. I love a spear point blade. Now, I know, look, I love a sheep's foot too. And you just saw, I did my unboxing and that sheep's foot is good for getting down inside of stuff. But this is the most beautiful blade shape, in my opinion, of a traditional. I just absolutely, and look at that hollow. It is, so, and this mean looking fat bellied spear with a, you know, forget about everybody with their, uh, uh, shoot, what, what, harpoon blades. I mean, this swedge makes a wicked looking harpoon. I mean, it really does. Look at that. And of course, you've got that beautiful satin finish. Jack Wolf knives over here, M390. I don't know what's up with my focus. M390 here. But that twill is just stealing the show. But here's where we go, guys. This is the deal. Uh, you got It's called a dog leg because of this shape, like a dog's leg. And you've even got like the foot down here. Uh, but when I held this for the first time at Blade Show, this is what it was about for me. Melted into my hands and you actually end up with a slight tilt forward, almost like a, a slight pistol grip. And... You know, you can get down into stuff better than you would think uh, with this because of the way that handles. So whoever came up with the dog leg pattern first, applause to you. Uh, very, very good. But man, this is just I can't get over how well finished they are. I wish we could find out uh, who the manufacturer. Now, I'm going to not go into numbers and all this stuff. We will do one comparison here in just a moment. Um, but I, I'll save the walk and talk. Well, we'll hear the walk and talk, but we're not going to talk a lot about the, um, the numbers, although I will go ahead and tell you, yeah, it's right where Ben would want it to be. It's in that six to seven range to me, obviously a little lighter on this first pull and then a little stiffer on that. And I would call it close to a seven there. Same thing. Yeah, very much so. Very nice. All right. I said I wasn't going to do it, but I did. Uh, really nice. And again, you guys know you've got your nail nick here, uh, and you can get that. But for me, I'm just a, I'm a grabber, a pincher here. I just, uh, reach in there. It's just easier for me, uh, cause I don't keep nails really to speak of. Uh, but real, I just love this. Now here's our one comparison. Let's move the cloth off to the side. We're just going to put, uh, the midnight out here just to give you that size comparison now obviously it's pretty much the same size it looks a little different because one's kind of crooked and the other one's straight uh, but very very nice now here's the slip it comes with uh, and guys uh, don't underappreciate these slips they're really nice always slip uh, whoops right in here really easily. Now you got that dog leg to account for, so make sure you allow some room, but goes in there really, really nicely, comes out really, really easily. I love it. And then you've got the packaging. Uh, here, let me put, I got to put it where you can see Jack Wolf there and the dog. I love that. So uh, very nice, Ben. Good choice on the twill carbon fiber, my friend. Way to uh, stick this one in there, guys. And just so you know, um, these are going to be available. Oh man, I'm going to blank on the date. So give me half a second just to make sure I got it right. I think it's the 12th. Yep. That's it. August the 12th and all the dealers. Now, if you go to Ben's website, you will see these are going to drop and I'll have my review before the 12th. Um, but these, these are going to drop next Friday, not this coming Friday, but Friday the 12th of August, 2022. At 2 p.m. Eastern, 11 a.m. Pacific, uh, at all the dealers. You got White Mountain, you got SMKW, you've got um, Blades Capone, you got traditional pocket knives. I'm going to leave somebody out. Um, yeah, you got all the great dealers. I think he's got, uh, if I remember, DLT and Blade HQ. And, and you know, go, go find the one you want to support and the one you want to uh, look at. But these are going to be. Uh, 275 for the two micarta versions, which are um, uh, natural micarta and green, OD green. And then you've got this twill and a red dark matter fat carbon uh, for uh, 299, I believe. Uh, and again, they're going to be at all those dealers. You can go to Jack Wolf Knives. Uh, website, which I will have down in the description and see all of the, the dealers there and uh, the four options. So yeah, and right now I'm just going to tell you, 
uh, the twill carbon fiber is my favorite. Not just because it's the one in my hand, uh, but because I think it's just, I think when I get this outside, it's going to shine like crazy and just be absolutely gorgeous. So really loving it. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this one. Thank you, Ben, for sending it along. I love the mid—I love all of them, but the midnight is really cool as well. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know. Give me a a thumbs up and a comment down below of what you think about this one. Are you going to be looking for one? And uh, thank you so much for all your support and for watching the Knives Fast channel.